cows sit on ties, but apparently human beings to sit on ties. Young Ghanaian eco enthusiast Hannah is making that a reality by transforming old ties into beautiful and functional set of furniture, throw pillows, shoe racks, among others, with her sense of creativity and affinity for the environment. According to her, she was inspired to venture into this business due to the widespread of pollution caused by these old tires. These are my own ideas. No one taught me. Okay. It came to my mind to use old car tires to make furniture. Okay. And so I started with only a table. I went to pick a car tire, old car tire. Then I went to buy red and white cloth and made a table out of it. With a capital of 300 cities and social media as a promotional tool for her business, Hannah says the car tie artistry work has been very profitable until the current harsh economic pressures set in. I went to work for a client. I made the estimate it was about 1,850. The next time I went to the market, all things I bought were almost 2,300. 50, 65. I was like, well, I was shaking. And so the way the infl inflation is affecting our business, sometimes you you lose customers because mm. something which was previously, let's say, 1,000, because the inflation is now 1,005. The person, 500, he or she may not get at that particular time. Passionate about promoting made in Ghana products, Hannah debunks the assertion that locally made products are substandard. Made in Ghana products, are very quality like it just came to my mind to use the kente to do the shoe rack you mm. wouldn't see this anywhere apart from mm. the old lady carpenter yes so it, it when some people see it i have customers in abroad some they prefer the one made with kente when they see it it, it looks beautiful Hannah is calling on more young entrepreneurs to venture into the artistry business to help promote local products and save the environment.